bless you, Evangelist Rob here. We're in day nine of our solemn September assembly every day. I've been coming on here asking you to join your faith with my faith. Because, friends, when we pray together, things shift. There's alignment that happens in the heavenlies. God positions and opens the heavens. Bowls of incense become filled and spill back over on the earth. Many prophetic people are saying this month, September, is pivotal. We don't want to wait for the enemy to attack us, and then we react to his attack. We want to be preemptive, preventative. We want to be on the offense. But before I continue, I am live this month, September, 9 p.m. Eastern New York time, live on YouTube, Monday nights, 9 p.m., and then 8 p.m. live Zoom where we pray. If you want to be loose to pray, dude, raise your hand in the chat if you're proven prophetically and you know how to pray or you just want to learn, just come on and catch the spirit of impartation because the impartation is not taught, it's caught, but the Zoom code is 860-2818-6105. So Mondays, 9 p.m. Eastern, I'm live YouTube preaching, prophesying, and praying. And then live Tuesdays, month of September, we may go into October, live Zoom, 8 p.m. Now we're using here a foundation of Hosea 10, verse 12, sow for yourselves righteousness, reap in mercy, and break up the fallow ground. The fallow ground is our heart that needs to be broken up. So when God wants to plant and impregnate the seed of what he's doing in the now, it can bear fruit. And take it can take root and bear fruit. Joel chapter 1 and verse 13. Gird yourselves and lament, you priests. Well, you who minister before the altar. Come lie all night in sackcloth, you who minister to my God. Consecrate a fast. Call a sacred or solemn assembly. And cry out to the Lord. Father, we know where there's a cry. There's always a hope. We're crying out. We're positioning ourselves for a move of God. We're like the priests that are taking the horns of the altar. And Father, we're pleading with you. And Lord, I believe you spoke to me. If my people will repent, then I will relent. So we're crying out. We're repenting. Second Chronicles seven fourteen. If my people who are called by my name will humble themselves, pray, seek my face, Turn from their wicked ways. You'll hear from heaven. You'll heal their land. God, we're asking for healing all across America, all over the world. And Father, we know in Matthew 24, you spoke about judgment, wrath, the signs of the times, beginning of sorrows, birth pangs, perilous times. Jesus, keep us in your grip. Strengthen us. Let us have endurance. Let us endure to the end. Give us grace for the race. And Father, we thank you for Joel 2, 12. Now therefore, says the Lord, turn to me with all your heart, with fasting, weeping, and mourning. Fasting, weeping, and mourning. Rend your heart, not your garment. Return to the Lord, for he's gracious and merciful. He relents from doing harm. Who knows if he will turn and relent. Hey, thank you, those that come on here and join your faith and pray with me. I believe it's important. Otherwise, I wouldn't be doing it. Any, All of us could be doing a lot of other things besides praying. But prayer and keeping the hedge up for protection is where we stand in the gap as watchmen like Ezekiel 33. And we're blowing the trumpet. We're sounding the alarm. We're going up. We're blowing the trumpet. We say there's warning coming. Prepare yourself. Many prophetic voices are saying, brace yourself. Again, it'd be an honor if you subscribe to the channel. Hit the like button. Any specific prayer requests, put them in the comment section. Again, live prayer Monday, 9 p.m. Eastern YouTube. And live prayer Tuesday, 8 p.m. Zoom. Blessings.